Now for today's tutorial, we're gonna learn the use, one of the uses of RSI. So since me as a pattern trader, I also use RSI for my pattern. As you could see, I have here three examples of, uh, of a currency pair and I have used also the RSI as a form of confirmation, as a form of uh, profitable trade. So before anything else, um, to be able to be consistently, uh, consistently win or to be able to identify yourself what kind of trader you are, it is a must for us. It's okay, honey. You could, okay. It is a must for us to, no, to be able to understand the five basic tools. And one of these is the RSI. So, right now, we're going to talk about RSI as one of the tools that I'm going to use on my pattern trades. So, here it goes. Uh, here you could see I have I have here a pattern and definitely this is a Gartley pattern yeah then as a Gartley pattern uh, you could trade on this side and also on the formation on this side see as you can see also on RSI it's already more than like it's already overbought, so it's time to sell. And as you can see also on the pattern, which is on the C point, it is where we could see that if we took the trade over in this area, we will be benefiting, we will be winning our trade. There you go. And that goes also with the D point, which is the confirmation of the Gartley pattern. On the Gartley pattern, you could see that the RSI already is overbought, right? And it's below 30. By the way, for my RSI, uh, I only have uh, the price line will be the overbought will be 70 and the oversold will be 30. That's my RSI uh, setup. Now, let's go for another currency pair. Here is a butterfly a pattern, which, which the completion of the D, where you could see it here, we could see that it has hit the overbought mark. See, that's the overbought mark that we are. Uh, it's a sign for us that we have to go trade down. And, and another pattern. Here, this is also a butterfly pattern again. On the 4 hours chart, this is 4 hours chart. You could see a butterfly pattern at on the D point, it's about time for us to go up. And it did really go up, right? Uh, with a confirmation also of the RSI, and there is an overbought on this area. There you go. So, basically... I'm using the overbought, the oversold, but I integrated it with the pattern since I am a pattern trader. Now, uh, again, for you to identify yourself who you are, not everybody is a pattern trader, not everybody likes to trade on patterns, but uh, to know who you are and what kind of trader you are, you have to... Uh, Search, you have to learn these five basic tools. And this in these five basic tools, it's there you could see, it's there you, you would know the type, the kind of trading that you would like. And to make it easy for you guys, I have created a tutorial on this. Just go to YouTube. Then... On the YouTube, you search Uling Sailu. That's my channel. There, just click that one. This is me, Uling Sailu. 
and on the playlist you could see on the playlist i have here the forex basic tool there you go just click on that forex basic tool playlist and you will find it there the five basic tools have you heard of one in daybreak trade the five basic tools that you must learn uh, for you to identify what kind of trader you are. So that's it. And uh, hope you have a very nice trade for this week.